Hi, I'm Charles with Clive Coffee, and today I'll be showing you how to set up your Luca Atom Espresso Grinder with True Grind. Step one, out of the box and onto the counter. Remove the grinder from its box and place it on a solid level surface. Inspect it for damage, and if you notice any, contact us immediately. Insert the hopper into the top of the grinder, and then open the lock at the base of the hopper. Now plug in the grinder and turn it on. Step two, connecting with your grinder. Normally, this is where I'd instruct you on feeling the coffee and dialing in. With the Luca Atom, that's not necessary. Out of the box, every Luca Atom comes dialed into a setting that's good for most coffees. Further, and more importantly, with the True Grind app available on the Apple App Store and Google Play, you can download profiles for a wide variety of coffees and let the grinder determine the proper setting. Once you've downloaded the app, simply create an account and follow the setup instructions to connect your grinder to your Wi-Fi network. With your grinder now connected to the internet, tap the menu icon in the bottom right corner of the grinder's screen to check for firmware updates and download the update if one is available. Now that the grinder is up to date, head to the profile page in the app to enter the specifications for your espresso machine. Step three, dialing in and pulling shots. If you're brewing a coffee from the coffee library in the True Grind app, you can select that coffee from within the app and pick your preferred brew ratio. Then tap Save to Grinder, and that preset will be available through the menu icon in the bottom left corner of the grinder's display. Once selected, the grinder will suggest a grind setting at which to start, saving you a lot of time and coffee. Now you'll want to grab your scale and tear your portafilter. Grind into your portafilter until it looks about full and then weigh it. We're looking for 20 grams as we're using a 20 gram or triple basket. Luckily, the profile's pre-programmed grind setting should get you precisely 20 grams. With grounds in the basket, tamp straight down and lean your weight into it comfortably. The amount of pressure is not nearly as important as your consistency and your ability to keep the tamp perfectly level so water doesn't find weak spots. Insert your portafilter and start the shot. As the shot progresses, we'll observe the total shot time. If you're using a true grind profile, you'll find the ideal target shot weight in the grind profile for your coffee of choice. Otherwise, simply shoot for 30 grams as your target. Stop your shot once you've reached the target in your recipe and compare the time it took to the target time listed in your recipe. Thanks to the True Grind system, you're likely right on the money or within a second of your target shot time. If you find that you're a second or two off, make a small adjustment coarser to decrease shot time or a small adjustment finer to increase shot time. Sticking to small adjustments will be easier than making big changes and overcorrecting. The Luca Adams grind setting readout makes this a lot more straightforward. Stick to making changes of just one or two numbers at a time. If you've found a grind setting you prefer, remember to head to the app, open the corresponding profile, and change the number to your preferred setting. Tap Save and head to the home screen to save this updated profile to your grinder. Step four, timed dosing. Now that we have our grind setting dialed in, we can set up our grind timer for consistent and repeatable dosing. Again, thanks to the True Grind profile, the grinder should give you almost exactly the desired dose out of the gate. With the hopper filled, tear your portafilter on a scale and then simply press your portafilter against the grind button it'll automatically stop after the designated time. Now weigh your portafilter again to double check the dose. You'll likely find that this precaution was unnecessary as the grinder already did the work for you, so now we're ready to go on to pulling espresso. If you do find the dose is slightly off target, simply adjust by a few tenths of a second at a time until you're spot on. Once you've found the perfect timed setting, you can save it to the coffee's profile by tapping the profile, adjusting the target grind time to match, and then tapping save. If this video helped you set up your Luca Atom, be sure to hit the like button. If it didn't, or if you have any other questions, I'd be glad to field them in the comments below. For more coffee knowledge, tap subscribe, and as always, thanks for watching.